we have a virtual exhibition from the 1st to the 16th of May, and then we have a physical exhibition, which is really exciting, from the 17th to 24th of May. So I would like to introduce you to Louise Allison. Louise, welcome, and tell Thank me you. all about yourself. Well, what sort of art do you do? Well, I've always been drawn to sculpture. Um, I love it because, I mean, we see the world in 3D, mm -hmm. and so to me it makes sense to work in 3D. Um, I like being able to push something in if I see it goes in or pull it out if I see it comes out rather than have to sort of wrestle with translating what you see in 3D into 2D. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, I've always been drawn to sculpture, but when I went to art school, I decided that as I have to earn a living, I couldn't earn a living as a sculptor. So I studied graphic design oh, and okay. I became a graphic designer for all my professional life which I really enjoyed and it served me very well mm -hmm. because it taught me how to look and it taught me to be very accurate. Um, but since I retired, um, I've now gone back to my first love, which is sculpting, and I found my passion. I love it. Fantastic. That's Absolutely great. Love it. So mm -hmm. is there anything in particular that you sculpt? Yes, um, I'm fascinated by by the human face. Right, okay. And um, I mean, we carry our character and our personality mm. in our face. Mm. And to me, the great challenge is to try to be able to capture that. Um, and it's quite a challenge. Very challenging. Yes, I mean, yes, I'm a, an artist at the painting, yeah. <laughs> so I agree entirely. It's very, yeah. very difficult. Yeah. Yes. And um, mm. I find that I find that very exciting. Mm. However, I also really enjoy doing sort of little caricatured figures right. of both people and animals. Um, and I try to make them as much fun as possible. And again, to capture uh, sort of quirkiness and char character, almost like a cartoon. Oh, right. That's fantastic. Yeah. That's brilliant. That's great. So you differentiate one and the other. In terms of actually how you start to work on a face, for instance, will you do sketches or photographs first? How would you do that? No, I just work directly. Um, oh. I work in clay, mm -hmm. mostly in, in hand-built um, clay, which I get fired to uh, stoneware. Right. Though sometimes I work in craft crank. Mm -hmm. It depends what I'm doing. Um, and yeah, I just go straight into uh, working with the clay, I'm told by people who know a great deal more than I do, I'm sure, that to do a lot of sketches mm. first is probably a great help. Right, okay. But well, I suppose do that. It, <laughs> you get the angles and, mm. and what have you, but I think it's it's a great talent that you have that you can actually look at a face mm. and start to cons construct or mm. put that together mm. by looking at somebody. And I think it's, it's so important to get that, that look and the sort of character of the person coming across, yeah. really. Yeah. So would you say it's a real passion of yours? Oh, complete passion, mm. total passion. Yeah. I love it. And I mean, I don't know where I'd have been in lockdown if I hadn't had that yeah. because um, it enabled me to, I, I work at home, mm -hmm. um, though not all the time, I also work in other studios, um, but it, it gave me something to do with being creative yeah. and it stopped me sort of going bonkers really. Yeah, well, that's, yeah. that's really good. <laughs> so a uh, question for you, um, as we're having a physical exhibition, which is terribly mm -hmm. exciting, um, what do you want the viewer to feel when they see your work? Yeah. <laughs> That's a difficult question. Um, hopefully, it would be nice if they were amused by the mm -hmm. little pieces um, and uh, perhaps moved by the bigger pieces, mm -hmm. the, the more serious pieces, the, the, the uh, portrait pieces. Yeah. Okay, brilliant. Well, listen, it's been a pleasure chatting you this afternoon. I hope you do really well at the exhibition. I'm Thank sure you. you will do. Thank, Thank you very you much very for coming much. along. Thank, Thank you. you.